Hello everybody, my name is Meister Blue, and today I'm taking a look at the game Helen's Mysterious Castle. This is one that I found on playism-games.com, which is a it's an indie site for uh, games that are made, made by indie developers or indie individual people over in Japan, and it's actually really cool because I've been able to find some really neat things on there. This, I think, was only $1.99 when I picked it up. I might have to check again, but I will, of course, have the link to this in the description of this video. I decided I wanted to take a look at it. I wanted to finally crack into it. This is an RPG Maker game, I think. I'm pretty sure it looks like it, especially from the frame of the box, which I'm going to have to mess around with in the editing and whatnot. I don't know if I'm going to make it stretch out to the full video or leave it as its um, aspect ratio or not. Something I'll decide in post. But yes, let us take a look at this. Oh, look at that. Look at me. I look adorable. You mustn't go near the northern ruins. They're dangerous. Can I talk to you with something? Another button? Oh, say A is another talk. Oh yeah, this this definitely has feels of um. Oh, that was a really, that was a really nice little animation for that. Got a longbow, sweet. Open the menu with escape and dash. Does that say dash? With shift. Oh yep, dash with shift. Really cool little animations going on here, stuff that I've never been able to get done in um, when I was using it. Alright, so I got a longbow, that's nice. Can I, is there anything else in here? It's empty. Oh no. Oh no. Yum. Oh, I do like that you give you a dash option. A lot of these games don't really give you the option to dash. Then again, a lot of them aren't big enough to really like make a difference. But it's not. it's nice having the option. Bah, bah. Now I don't know if this game was translated by somebody or not, or if it was from the creator, like, written like this. One thing I will say is that the font is a little difficult for me to read, personally. Ooh! That ain't a longbow, that's a sword! There's my longbow. Shoot it! Yes! Kill it! Kill the body blow! Wait, his name is Body Blow? Fanfare, fanfare for the wind. Also, hopefully my lighting isn't all crazy. I'm trying out, I'm trying out a bunch of different lighting things now because I want to be able to do these videos later at night too, because it's when I'm the most free. So I'm hoping that this lighting situation of mine works. Uh, you can't read this. Hmm. Ooh, I see sparkles. It was a glamorous space I just made. I think that healed me. Um, escape. Yep, healed me. Sweet. Are you a fortune teller? Are you a fortune teller, can I talk to you? Oh, no. I am a combat expert. You shall think of me as your teacher. Huh? Hmm, no, your master. Think of me as your master, that's cooler. I live here teaching, the, teaching those I deem worthy how to defeat... I thought I said Monglers at first. No, that's monsters. If you come across a new type of enemy, come talk to me. I'll give you a hint on how to defeat them. Ah, oh, sweet. Another treasure chest. Wooden shield. Ooh. Take it. Oh, no. It's a trap. Ooh. Do I get an option to use my shield or a longbow in, a, in the attacks and whatnot? I'm trying to look at all these things and figure out what everything means, but... See, try the wooden shield. Ooh, that just deflect took dang all the damage I would have taken. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I'm wondering what, what's the weight stat for? Is that like the speed of the round? Oh, I'm digging this. I'm really digging this. Ooh, it's a goblin. I will destroy it. Wait, it says weight five down there is my one, or not my one, my longbow. 
The weight up there says zero. I'm going to defend. Okay. Now it says weight 12 up there. I'm assuming that's how long it takes for him to attack. When it gets down to zero is when he can hit. So if I'm planning it right, I can use the shield on his attacks and make it so I don't take much damage. That, If that's what it is, then that's pretty awesome. I like that. Ooh, there's a sword in the floor! I'm gonna fight. I'm just gonna fight all the way through. Let's see, what's this guy's weight? Uh, I guess I can't see it until this turn. Alright, see if I can hit him again. And then the weight goes down to zero, and he hits. Yes! I think I figured it out! I figured this! I got this! Longbow! That's awesome. It's like it's like rolling initiative, and I like that. I love rolling initiative. Is that a skelly man? That's a skelly man. Let's kill it. Uh, longbow. Ooh, he went down five. I'm gonna shield. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, he goes down five per turn for his weight. So okay, it's getting. Ah, I should have blocked. Okay, he's at nine. There. Wooden shield. Uh, so it also takes my weighting into account when I'm defending. When it, See at the bottom of the screen, it says weight eight for my shield and weight five for the longbow. So if I'm defending, then I have to use more time in order to defend. So I have to like calculate the math between his weight and my weight and like how what's all going to happen. So I think I defend twice. So I'm going to defend once. He'll be able to hit again, so I'll defend again. He'll be able to hit again, so I will defend one more time. And he can't hit this turn, so longbow. There we go. Yes. Oh, he's gonna be able to hit again. I'm wondering if the wooden shield can break. Uh, I, uh, he, he hit me. He did like half of my health in one hit. So I'm assuming that I'm really effective to learn this and be able to get this down. Otherwise, I probably would have been dead by now. Wait again. This is a really neat little game. I'm liking this. I'm really liking this. And not just because I have the option of using a bow and a shield. Long bow. Boom! He's dead. You win. Game three XP. I need to. Uh, I hope they don't respawn when I go back downstairs. I need to get my health back. That that one hit hit me bad. Sprinting in this place seems to be too fast for me to personally control. And yeah, they do respawn. Ooh. Alright, skip past that blob. Is that a pig? Is that a moblin? Health Health Oh, booster. The S and the the S looks like a G to me in this. I thought it said Health Boogler. Alrighty then. Hit him first, see if he... Okay, he can't hit me. Good. Wooden shield. Boom! I'm get, I'm digging this. I'm getting into it now. Nah, getting into it. Wondering, I'm wondering what happens later. If I get more teammates and everything. Like how their their weight turns weight, or effect into it. Like if it's an overall thing. Gotta do the simple mathematic. Let's see. Yep, he'll be able to hit me next turn. Yep. He won't be able to hit me next turn. No, he will not. Yes! I'm getting it. I'm calling it. I'm getting this down. I've got this. This is going to be fantastic. Yes. Ah, I will take no hits from you today, Skelly Man. What's his effect? What's the effectiveness? Is that how much damage he does? Oh yeah. See, my defense changes when I'm using that, so that's why he did 14 damage to me. He would do 16 if I didn't have that. He does nothing to me when I have this, because my defense with this outweighs his effect. Effectiveness, I'm assuming, is what that means. Hopefully that's what that means. Efficiency, maybe? That could also work. Either way, it means attack. I also like the music. The music's pretty nice too. Pretty standard uh, JRPG music going on. Um, 
I'm wondering if I can hit him first. I'd only do two damage to him, and I don't know what his health is, so I'm gonna hold off. Because I don't want to take a hit from him. Alright, longbow. Yep, it would have taken me another hit. I'm wondering if I can hit him before he hits me, because if that happens, I can kill him. I'm gonna try it right here. Yes, I can! Sweet! You win 3 EXP. Awesome! Hmm. There's moblin guys down there. Ooh, what are these? What the fuck is that? Is that a golem? Is that a big ass golem? I don't think I want to fight that. Yeah, there's a book over there I want to go find. I'm gonna go find the. Oh, damn it! It's a goblin. Hit him with a longbow. Pew pew! Okay, he goes down five every turn. He has. Oh, he's even more powerful than the Skelly Man. That's dangerous. I gotta say, the sprite animations for this game look really cool. Oh, he's got a long wait now. Oh, yeah, hell yeah. Oh, crit hit, take that! Oh, yeah. I don't know why he had such a long wait after that. The skeleton dancing at me. Take this! Die, you fiend! Swoyam! Wooden shield. Swoyam! Can I get some critical hits against you? Oh, I forgot. Damn it. Okay, I got a health boogler with me. I should not have shielded. I shielded in major, major defense. Yeah. There we go. Now I can start smacking him. This game is a game you have to pay attention to. This is, you have to, this isn't just like, this isn't just a game where you can just like, kind of like, I'm just gonna use a flamethrower on everything to get it by. No, you have to watch for the wait, because if not, then you'll be here like twice as long if you miss your attacks. And I'm wondering what the up, what any upgraded weapons like give you. If they make your, if you can like eventually choose between wanting defense, weight, or efficiency. Ooh, he's going in for a crit there. I think, oh no, that's just a normal. Boom! Pretty quick pace strategy with this game seems like. Sitting here wondering where I'm going to put the my video, like my, my camera. Up on. I'm thinking the top right because I'm just thinking, hmm. If I don't want to put it on the bottom left, I'll cover the HP of my character. I want to put it on top left to cover the stats of the monster. Wooden shield. I'm not going to be able to kill him in that head unless it's a big one. Yep. Longbow. Oh, he hit me first. Oh no. I have 2 HP left. I gained 3 XP. When do I level up? When do I level up? Oh god, I need to level up. 21 experience points. How do I use my uh, boosty? My my HP boost thing. Um, how do I? How do I do? Woo! Oh, I can save. Boom! I'm gonna save there. I want to use my my. Ooh! You use experience points to level things up. Ooh, I'm liking that. I'm liking this. Upgrade my longbow. Yeah, I like that. Okay, now, how do I use my? What did that was that an item? And just like, okay, what's that in here? Nothing. Is there anything in there? Nothing. There's another pot. Nothing. Pick up this book. A Tome of Thunder. Whoa. Okay, it's like. Oh, 35 damage! A 20 weight, though. Or is that 20 defense? No, it's 20 weight, and it has defense piercing. I'm gonna take that with me. Oh! Oh, God, the mummies came out! Oh, God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Thank... Dear God, these things have so much better stats now. Oh, no. Oh! Oh, don't hit me! Okay, they go down by five. Decent hits in on him. And defense. Oh god, no! He killed me! 
Ow, oh, you killed me dead. Mummy came out of nowhere. Thunder was stolen. No. Why? I didn't use the thunder thing anyway. I made you a steak. Thanks. It's not really sick food or like you just almost died food. My max HP has been increased. Oh. Well, that's nifty. Ooh. Oh, I got some boosties from dying. Is this one of those types of games? Where death makes you stronger? That sounds awesome! I'm gonna continue on. I gotta go. Let's see, did my did my items still Yeah, my items are still up. Dang, that's that's nice. I like that. Oh, I can talk to this guy about monsters. The slimes are causing you trouble. No, they're not. Block their attacks with the shield. Okay. We weren't talking about anything I needed! I want to find that sword. Get out of here, slime. Skelly man, let's see how you fare against me now. Longbow. Oh, boy, I'm. <laughs> Alright, note to self. Don't go for the book. The book leads to mummies killing you. That mummy did six damage to my shield, so it had a 20... That mummy must have had like a 28, uh, 28 effectiveness, because I have a 22 shield right now. I should not have done that. Being stupid. Being more stupid. Uh. Okay, so it can attack me first if its wait time is l uh, less than my wait time. So now I can hit it and kill it. Dear people in the background, I apologize. We have they have a Super Bowl party going on. Me, I don't like football, so I'm sitting around in here just like, nope, not gonna put up with that. Oh, it fought me. I was trying to avoid it. Slime, die. <laughs> it's just dead. It's just dead. Oh, can I upgrade things anymore? I'm at two experience points. All right. I'm understanding the system now. You don't become strong unless you find the health things. Your enemies become... They stay. They seem to stay at the same strength. At least in the ones I've been fighting lately. But you... Your weapons become the main thing. Alright, smack it once. My wooden shield now does defense of 24. So that's really, really good. Wham. I'm starting to get the hang of this. Really starting to get the hang of it, and I'm I'm digging it. I'm really digging this. This is a really cool little idea of an RPG. I think I can win. Yes, I can. If our wait times are equal, it makes me go first. That's good. Three experience points. Don't touch the book. That's okay. Just don't touch the book. However, I'll try fighting this guy before this video is over because I'm at 18 minutes so far right now. So. I can't go over 30 minutes because that's when my camera shuts off. Ooh, we got some Ninja Turtle music going on. Name Bulldoze. I can't hit him. I I can't hit him. Oh no. Can I can I like run? Can I like run? Please? I can't do a single damage to him because his defense is 15. What's he gonna do to me? I'm just gonna let him. I've gotta let him kill me. I don't think I can leave. I can't run from the fight. I guess I have to get the lightning in order to actually beat this guy. He's got massive defense. So I have to go get that book. And I have to defeat the mummy after that. Oh, God. Oh. This is... This is gonna be challenging. I can see that. Alright, hit me. Please don't take any of my items. Nothing was taken. Good. Good morning, Helen. I made you a steak. You and your steak! Prefer chicken. Thank you very much. Max HP increase points. So every time you die, you get a little bit more HP. That's awesome! That's really awesome! So... Oh, bookcases. Huh? 
You can't read this. It's in a foreign language. Oh, but this is really cool. It's kind of, it makes me feel like Dark Souls, where every time you die, you're supposed to get better at the game, so it makes the game a little easier for you. It doesn't make the game easier. Your skill increases, and it makes you better at the game, because you're getting better at the game yourself. It seems something like that, only old-school JRPG style, and I really, really dig that. But yes, I seem to be out of time for this video. I want to check more of this out. If I do, of course I will have videos of this. Let me know if you guys want to see the videos too. And if, if you guys like this one, of course I will put more of this up. Because this is a really interesting little RPG I'm, I've found. Again, it's called Helen's Mysterious Castle. I found it over on... Pull up the page. Uh, I can't find the page. Not cool. I will, of course, have it in the link to the description. I mentioned it in the beginning of this video. Go check this out if you want to. If you want to see it, it's two dollars. I'm pretty sure on the site that I picked it up in, and it's legit because when I picked it up, it just gave me the download. Worked out for perfectly fine. I think I was able to use PayPal for it. So yes, it's it's a legit site. But yes, thank you all for watching. If you want to see more of my stuff, I will, of course, have a video linked after this so go check that out go check out some other things of mine if you like my videos think you have other friends who would like my videos please share them it does me a lot of help when you guys get sh share my stuff you can go find me on tumblr or twitter and chat with me recommend games or anime to me i'm likely going to listen to every recommendation i get because i don't get my recommended stuff that often so yes my name is ben meister blue and until next time everybody peace out similar to the giant like Cthulhu like being that you see in the background like the very first episode of the game. But yes, the premise of this show is about these giant